Hello everyone, welcome again to Jira Cloud Tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how you can add subtasks in Jira. Now, before we get into any project and understand how to add the subtask, let me first go to the whiteboard and we have understood about the issue hierarchy into the Jira Scrum project. When you create a Scrum project, these are the default issue types that you will get. Uh, epic task story bug and subtask now we have understood that epic is basically a big piece of work that might span across multiple sprints then uh, the task story and bug are below epic which most probably fit within one sprint or two weeks cycle in the scrum software development now subtask is the issue type which can be created either for the task or the story or bug to further divide these pieces of work into smaller manageable pieces of work. So for example, there is a story that needs to be implemented by the developer so he can create the subtasks within that particular story. So the first subtask could be, say for example, implement the UI, the wireframe, the UI part. Uh, the second subtask could, could be to map the uh, API uh, or work on the REST API or the SOAP API for that particular, you know, implementation. And then third could be, you know, integrating the uh, service with the UI component. So these are some of the smaller items that he can divide or create the subtask within the story to work further so that there is a progress that can be seen within the particular sprint and that's why the subtask issue type is there to segregate or to, to divide the task or story or bug further into manageable piece of work all right so you can create subtask either for a task or a story or a bug okay and since jira cloud has different type of project and we have been focusing on next gen scrum next gen kanban classic scrum and classic kanban so i'll go ahead and show you how you can create subtask into any of these issues that you have in any of these projects right so for example if i go to the classic scrum project and to create a subtask you won't get any direct option to uh, create a subtask when you click on this create button so let me click on create button here at the top so as we have seen to create the user story in epic or bug uh, or task you can directly click on the create button and you can choose the issue type from here right now because the subtask is the child of either the story or bug or task so uh, you don't have that option to create the subtask directly from this create option here so what you can do is you simply have to go to a particular task say for example i want to create a subtask for this particular story okay so uh, story test story 5 so I can open this test story 5 and simply if you see this little icon which is basically create subtask okay so if you click on this create subtask icon the subtask section will open for this particular story okay so for example this particular story so I'll say subtask uh, implement UI okay so for example this is one of the a work item that needs to be done for that particular story I provide the detail and I click on create and you can see the subtask got created okay if you want to open the full detail of this particular uh, issue type RT5 you can open that and you will see the same create subtask icon available here and the button as well if you click on it it will open the same option to create the subtask right and you have this little icon for the subtask and this subtask is the child of this particular story. Now, because subtask can be created for tasks, for bugs as well, and any, you know, custom issue type that you add, you can enable subtask for that as well. So let me go back and show you how you can add the subtask for a task. So if I go to the task, say for example, just click on the task on the board and you have the same option to create the subtask within the task and if I go to the defect so there are no defects at the moment let me quickly create one to show you how to add so 
I'll say test bug. Let me create one and let me open this bug. So now within this bug, the option to create subtask will be exactly same. All right, so this is the bug. Just click on create subtask and subtask section will open. And this is subtask. So provide the detail, subtask for bug and subtask gets created for it. All right. If this particular, you know, bug is on the board, say for example, if it is available on the board, say RT board, let me open it. Then the, once you click on that particular bug, then you will get the option to create subtask in the right side, similar as we got for this task and for the user story. Now subtask, you, uh, if you go to the epic, you can't create subtask because, so let me go to the epic and show you uh, in, in the uh, issue, if I click on create issue in the epic, because epic is the highest level of the issue type, which uh, is the big piece of work that spans across multiple you know, um, cycles or multiple iterations. So epic has the child issue type of task, story and bug, but it you can't create subtask within the epic. If you want to create the subtask, they need to go either below the task, story and bug. And that's why this is the hierarchy that um, I explained. And this is important to understand that how the overall hierarchy of issues is defined in Jira, the default hierarchy uh, that you need to follow. If your Jira is customized within your organization, then you might have many other issue type and the hierarchy might be a bit different. Uh, but this default hierarchy will still remain same. It doesn't matter how much customization has been done for the issue type within your Jira instance. So this is how you can add the subtasks within the Jira project. Now this is the classic Scrum project. If I go back to the Kanban, classic Kanban project, uh, the option is still same. So I simply have to basically say, for example, this is the story. I want to create a subtask in this story. I select the story and then click on this create subtask icon. It will open the subtask section there. Okay. If I want to open the story detail view, so simply click on the detail view, it opened RCK3 and I can click on create subtask to create subtask within this particular story from this particular button as well. All right. Um, then going back again in the epic, you can't add the subtask. We have already understood. So this is this holds true across the Jira instance. It doesn't matter what type of project you are working on right so hierarchy will still be similar like we have seen here all right now going back to the um, next gen project let's go to the next gen project and let's go to next gen kanban so here in next gen kanban if you want to add a subtask to this particular say for example task issue type just open that and click on add a child issue all right so when you click on add a child issue you can say subtask one whatever name you want to specify to this particular issue uh, then click on create and the subtask will be added to this particular task all right so that's how you will add a subtask in the next gen kanban project uh, now there are other type of issues as well so for example let me create a, a story and then i'll say test story as of now and if I want to add a subtask, simply add a child issue, right? And it will add a subtask in, into the next gen Kanban project. You can also add a subtask from the story detail. So if I open the story detail from the story detail on this page, you will have this add a child issue icon as well. All right. Now going back to the next gen scrum project. So let me open next gen scrum project. The process of adding the subtask is exactly same. So select the task, click on add a child issue and add the child issue within this particular story. If it is a story, you add a child issue. If it is a task, uh, the process will still be similar. Okay. You simply have to click on the task or bug and then click on add a child issue icon to add a subtask within that particular so if you just remember these issue type, default issue type that uh, Jira comes out with, 
then subtask can be added to a task to a story to a bug and we have already seen how you can navigate through different type types of project within jira cloud and open the issue detail to add the subtasks all right so that's all for this tutorial how to add subtask in jira hope you like it please do share and subscribe and thank you for watching